My name is Priscilla, currently pursue a diploma in Hotels and Leisure Facilities Management from the School of Design and Environment. And you're watching Of Course MP, where I'll be showing you what a day in the life of an MP student in my course is like. Let's go! My first lesson today starts at 10 a.m. Right now, I'm preparing my breakfast before I head for my classes. My course timetable for this semester has odd and even weeks on Wednesdays, where different classes will occur depending on that week. My first lesson today is Data Analytics and Research. This module talks about statistics, analytics and research in facilities and hotels. We will be taught on how to research, analyze and interpret data using different methods and softwares. Generally, the aim of this module is to put numbers into pictures with some design elements incorporated. The softwares that I'll be using are Tableau Desktop and Tableau Prep Builder. Today, I learned about descriptive, predictive and prescriptive analytics that is usually used in business analytics, as you can see from the slides. I know some of you may have questions regarding about my course, so I'm going to invite my lecturer, Mr. Sim, to answer some of your questions. Hi, Mr. Sim. Thank you for joining today. I have some questions to ask about the HRFM course. Sure. Firstly, what are some of the internships available and how will they help in building experience? The internships available for our diploma in uh, hotel leisure and facilities management are in several areas. We have internship placement opportunities for students in the hotel and leisure industry as well as the facilities management industry. But having despite that saying that because our course is actually a hybrid course between business, hotel leisure as well as facilities, our students do get to do internship in area of business opportunities too, such as marketing, sometimes events management. But of course, that depends very much uh, on the pandemic situation right now in Singapore. But uh, given our good relationship with the industry, so far we don't have actually any problem in placing our students out to the hotel and leisure industry. Okay, next question. How does the school help students in my course to keep up with emerging technology? First and foremost, uh, we work very closely with local universities as well as overseas universities. So our curriculum are also planned very much aligned with some of these feeding courses in the universities. In terms of helping our students to keep up to date with emerging technology, we work very closely with our industry partners to collaborate with us uh, to give students opportunities uh, to be very much involved in some of the projects that they are undertaking. So the students will be very much in tune and in touch with what the industry uh, is undergoing. Uh, after all, uh, Polytechnic is an institute of higher learning where we are preparing our students uh, for the industry. Thank you so much, Mr. Sim. Yeah, no problem. My pleasure. As I'm having a break before my next class, I'm actually going to go to the food club to get some waffles with my friends. Right now, I'm at my second lesson for the day, where I'll be learning about green building and energy management. We'll be learning about green building designs and technologies, and taught about energy management and how to conserve and reduce energy consumption in buildings. Moving on, I will also be having a practical session today, where we'll have a guided tour on Nian's building systems located at Block 22. For the guided tour, we will have to wear a wireless headset which is connected to my lecturer. As you can see in the video, we took a glance at the different supply air grills, air handling units, motors, cooling towers and more. And all of these are used for the air conditioning at Block 22. Right now, I'm at the library where I'll be studying and listening to the pre-recorded lectures about what was taught in my lessons. I really like the library as it is a quiet and conducive environment for me. The library also has facilities such as the printer where students can use if they need to print their worksheets. So that's it. I hope you've enjoyed a day in my life and tell us in the comment sections down below which course I'd like to see next. And I'll be heading home to study. Mm -hmm.